are 15 minutes away from the destination point. Guess where we're at? Hobbit. <laughs> we're super late. We're the last ones on the bus. Yes. Here we are going on the movie set. It is a walking tour. Um your baggage. Moore is here. Welcome to Hobbit. There's actually three people on this tour that haven't seen the movies nor read the books. We just did the count. So this guy's nickname back in school was Frodo. So a few of our schoolmates would for sure be happy to see him here. <laughs> back to the roots. He's got hobbit toes for sure. <laughs> Just a hobbit doing his work. Thank you. Oh, taking pictures in front of the hobbit houses. He looks super cute. We got one too. This tree over there is fake. Just imagine you go in here, it's so tiny. It's like I gotta, it opens up. Illegal. How was it? It's not big at all. There's actually nothing happening besides, I know, there's some plants in there, there's some shelves, mm. but it's only maybe one or two square meters. So it's nothing super spectacular. But I've been in one of these. No one's ever sent me mail. In the very beginning, they said that there's beer at the Green Dragon. That's the only reason why we're here, let's be honest. <laughs> There is beer. It's pretty good too. There you go. And bartender. And what would you like, man? Apple cider. Please. Apple cider? Yes. Apple cider. Yes. Yes. So you guys know it's 10:30 in the morning. Cheers. Cheers. All right, so we're still at Hobbiton, and I gotta say, it's magnificent. It's such a good time. Peter Jackson has created such an amazing world. Just to see it, it's worth the bucks that you pay for it. It's worth the money you spend on it. To get the cheapest tour, we got the earliest, it's not super busy, and you still have time to browse around, and you know, if you leave the group for a little bit, no one will say anything. We're on our way to Coromandel. Gotta make some food down there. Quick box and stop, the coastal drive is super exhausting, you can only drive like 50 kilometers per hour, it's all going up, it's going down, it's going squiggly lines, it's terrible. But the views up here are
just got to the campsite. It took us like six hours, five hours, four hours for 60 kilometers. It was all that coastal drive. Bad. We're all tired. That's where we're making some coffee now. The views here though are really great again. I'm gonna miss this as soon as I'm gone.